I don't know how many people realize it, but tonight is actually one month to the day since Kenneth passed, which is pretty pretty interesting. Um, so as it goes, without him with us, we have no choice but to turn the page and to start a new chapter without him. We're going to continue this. We're going to continue the legacy that he built. It's a new chapter for BWI, but it's already been written through Kenneth's legacy. And the legacy is, is you. It's you, it's you, it's you, it's you, it's you, it's you. It's everyone that's ever attended, because he, he did all that for, for everyone here to try to help people, try to make their lives better. So we all, we're all sharing that legacy. And we just want to move it through and keep it going. Um, so, you know, I can see a lot of familiar faces here that I've seen many times before. It's just a, it's a tribute. We just know that this thing is going to keep going just the way he would want it to. Um, so are you guys with me? Yeah. Are you with me? Yeah. Yes. Are you with me? Yeah. All right. <laughs> Sorry, I was channeling Kenneth there for a second. Um, okay, again, thanks everybody for coming and for keeping this dream alive. So we'll get started. Um, who's new here tonight? Wow. Oh, yeah. That's pretty awesome. Yeah, that's cool. yeah, that, you know, all the new people, you've just taken action. And in order to be successful, you have to take action in some way. And you're here, and that's a start. And success always has to start somewhere. And it's always by taking action. So I just encourage you to keep taking action. Keep coming. Learn as much as you can. Just look around. Get to know some people. There's a lot of people here that are very successful investors. There's a lot of deals that get done in this room. There's a nice community of people here. There's great sponsors. There's a lot of, there's a lot of help here for anybody that really, really wants to get serious about this. Um, there's a lot of venues you go to. There'll be someone who gets up and speaks, and it's just a pitch fest with a P, a pitch fest. <laughs> and at the end, they just want to sell you something. So you guys could put your checkbooks away, your credit cards. You're not going to need them tonight. We're not going to pitch anything. It's not what we're, that's not what we're about. Um, but there's just an abundant amount of resources here that you should definitely tap into if you're serious about doing this. Um, and, and another thing, we don't, we don't push and try to sell stuff, but membership here, I would really encourage you guys to join if, you're, if you feel like you want to do that and get involved. Um, it, helps, it helps to support this whole thing. You know, this venue, is, it's not inexpensive to hold, um, but you know, with the help of enough people, it can be a really, really big and great and prosperous thing for everybody. So essentially, I mean, what's been created here, and this is, you know, for the new people, there's just, it's a real close community. And this community has really been, it's an environment that was designed to help grow people and grow their businesses. And we've been involved for just about three years, um, and we've seen a lot of people really come to bloom and blossom and grow successful businesses. And we want to, we want to keep that trend going. And it's, really, it's really amazing to see what happens when people really dig in and do it. It's not an easy business by any means, but it's a great business. You get a lot of opportunities to help a lot of people. So, you know, all you new people, I'm really glad to have you here. And, um, you know, grab somebody afterwards, talk to them, find out what they're doing. Find out if whatever you can learn from them. People are very generous here with giving tidbits of advice and stuff like that. So definitely take advantage of that. So this this meetup, and I'm still addressing the new people for a second. Um, Bill Ames and Kenneth started this. How many years ago, Bill? Was it about three and a half years ago? And it started out with maybe three or four people coming to meetings, and then. It grew to about 30 to 40, and then once the venue came here, there's usually 100 
to 150 people on average would come. And that's pretty amazing. It's astounding growth in just a few short months. Although all the work was done in the background for the last three years. But um, I also want to um, mention our sponsors, which that's, that's a good handful of them right there. And we want to thank all of our sponsors. Because these sponsors really, they're here to help you. They have some really great products, really great services, and they help us keep the lights on and, and keep this thing going, too. So it's really important to reach out to them and, and try to do some business with them. All right, so we're going to um, get started with the regular venue now, and that starts with a quick pitch. And the way the quick pitch works is... If you, if you want to sell a deal, if you're looking to buy something, if you want to advertise your company, you get to get up in front of the whole group. You get 30 seconds, like a short commercial. You know you can do that, Clever. <laughs> so you get 30 seconds to do your pitch. That way we get, everybody gets a chance to come up. And then um, when 30 seconds is up, <laughs> I couldn't fit a gong in my car, so that's the best I could do. Okay, so who's first? Quick pitches? Okay, yeah. sir. This is a 30 second yeah. one, right? Yeah. Hi, my name is Judy Shanda. I'm with First Financial Security, one of the sponsors here, and uh, we have uh, an entire team. We just wanted to uh, share with you, we'll, we'll be giving a 10 minute presentation, but we are focused on educating you guys about alternatives and additional ways of holding your money for your investing with self uh, other than self-directed IRAs. So you'll be learning a little bit more about that later tonight. Thank you. Yeah, do you guys want a mic? That's right, I'm sorry. Okay. Yikes. <laughs> Hi, I'm Ricky Schneider. I'm a website and internet marketing specialist. I work with a lot of realtors, investment teams on online marketing and effective websites. I'm hosting a meetup in Glen Burnie. There's information on the back table. And again, I do the ultimate online marketing solution. But I'm also interested in learning more about real estate, and that's why I keep coming to these meetings. I have met a lot of great people here. And remember, I'm Ricky Schneider with Web Girl Technology. If your website is icky, call Ricky. <laughs> Hi, my name is Ian Barnes. Uh, I work with Fortitude, one of the sponsors. Uh, I'm just going to talk about our rehab and rental side because we're looking for a lot. Um, so as far as rehabs, uh, we look for properties that are around 60 to 100,000. Uh, we typically put 30 to 60,000 into them. So if anybody has rehabs in Baltimore City or Baltimore County, give us a call. Um, we also started buying rentals last month. So we bought three rentals last month. Uh, I want to give you the approximate type of rental that we look for. We're going to buy another five this month, another five next month, and another five month five after that. Uh, three bedroom, one bath, uh, purchase price of 25 to 35, rehab of 25 to 35, uh, long in front, no board ups, around 1,300 square feet. And if anybody has stuff in 21218, please let me know. Thanks. Phone number? Oh, phone number is 917 uh, Send me all the deals that you want. Thanks. Hey, wait a minute. You guys work together. You're getting like a <laughs> <laughs> Different side. Different side. <laughs> Uh, I'm Matt Lato. I'm with Fortitude as well. Uh, I wanted to add a little bit to what Ian said. Uh, on top of just doing the, the flips and the rentals, uh, and the criteria he gave for the flips, that's not our only criteria. We'll do higher value projects, everything else. Um, those are just kind of what we typically come across in the city. Uh, a lot of them in the county will we'll do much bigger or nicer parts of the city, anything. Um, also, I want to talk a little bit. We have a, a program we do for new investors. Uh, people are trying to get in, can't get a loan, don't have capital, experience, whatever it is. Uh, if you have a deal, preferably under contract, but at the very least with a budget and uh, you know realistic purchase price and everything, uh, let us know. Reach out to me. Um, we'll, we'll take it. We'll take it from there. Kind of walk you through it. We'll put all the money up. You know, or if you want to bring money, we'll we'll 
work out a different split based on that. Uh, we have one investor from this room a couple of months ago that he's got his first two deals under contract, or one under closed and one under closing this month with us, um, where he had been trying to figure out a way to do it. So it really does work. And my phone number is 540-538-4901. Thanks. <laughs> My name's Dave Wandell. I'm a roofing contractor and a rehabber. Um, so anybody, any roofing needs, give, give us a call. Uh, realtors in here, I do roof search for $175. I can get to them for you within 24 hours. And for your wholesalers, I'm looking for things on uh, east side of Baltimore County, Essex, Dundalk, Harry Hall area, and anywhere in Anne County. Phone number is 410 440 2991. Again, that's 410-440-2991. Hi, my name is Linda Green. I'm a partner sponsor with Legal Shield and ID Shield. So if you have issues where you want to talk to a law firm, a specialized attorney for any issue or your business. Or family situations, we can help you there. And along with ID, ID Shield, we can protect families with up to eight kids for a cost that's a little bit less than the competitor that's out there. From a real estate standpoint, I'm looking for private funding. Um, I want to talk to the gentleman that just spoke on a rehab bill and 21215. My number is 202 549 Hello, my name is Michael Johnson, and I'm a first-timer, and I have a deal. It's a house that my company personally rehab in Baltimore, and um, the address is 712 Richwood Avenue in Baltimore, Maryland, zip code 21212, and just for those who need to know, it's near John Hopkins University, Loyola University, and Morgan State University. <laughs> And it's a full rehab, and basically everything is done. Only thing you have to do is purchase the property and put the renter in. So please give me a call at 301 974 4572. And I have flyers in the back, and I also have flyers with me. Hi, my name is Andy Andrews, and um, I have, a, I have a short story, and I, it might exceed the third <laughs> second. So, if the police yank me, I, I, I'm still going to be trying to, to tell it. But um, I was, you know, I was working with with Ken Gills for a number of years, and um, uh, he he he. It's kind of impossible to, you know, impart what he gave to me over those years. But one of the things that I was talking to him about, I live on the Eastern Shore. Maryland and you know across the bay and so it's a smaller community and there's not as many people and there's there's no real estate you know groups like this and so I was talking to him I you know on phone calls and talking about how to connect with folks and so on and he kept saying well start your own meetup group you know <laughs> it's like just do it um, and I was kind of like well I'm just you know I haven't been doing this for that long and 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 and, but anyway, um, and so um, when he passed, um, I realized that it was time to do it. Um, and so, and so now we have the Eastern Shore Real Estate Meetup, um, and I, I have one location uh, that's that's set in stone pretty much, and I'm, I'm working on a second location. So I would encourage everybody to go to meetup.com, look up Eastern Shore Real Estate Meetup. Join the group. If you're interested in getting involved on the Eastern Shore with investing, um, you know, by all means, follow us. Come to the meetups. Um, everyone is more than welcome. If you would like to present, uh, I, I feel like there's kind of an untapped market over there. Uh, so, if you would like to present on something, let me know. I'd, I'd be happy to connect you with, you know, be happy to set you up with the group to present on something. My business cards are the little orange ones in the back. Uh, be the one who starts things. Um, so, 
so that's 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 one of them. <laughs> so I, I kind of see this as it, as like the uh, you know the the the, the the child of this group. You know, this this is started by, you know, Ken Gill's vision and, um, you know, the, every, everyone else who has anything to do with this group. And so I, I kind of feel a, a strong connection to this group. Um, and so I'm going to be talking about this group and my group. So I would, you know, I, I would really love it if anyone would you know, come to our group, or if you're an expert in some field, present at our group. Um, so that's that, and my second announcement is... That <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> We're working on multi-family cam multi unit campaigns and rehabs over there, so if you're interested in investing on the shore, grab a card or contact me. <laughs> Give me a call. <laughs> Hello, my name is Tanya B. Gox, and I am new to wholesaling. I am trying to uh, grow my buyers list. I work in Anne Arundel County, Howard County, Northern PG County. Um, if you buy from wholesalers or would like to buy from wholesalers, you can contact me and send me a criteria of what you're looking for, and, and hopefully we can do business. Uh, my phone number is 240-601-8247. That's, my name is Tandy Hecox, and 240-601-8247. And I have cards on the table. Hello, my name is Nagesh Kakalamudi. I'm an IT guy. Uh, so if you have any IT requirements or needs, uh, please call me. My the name of my company is ePerf. I have cards. I'll put my cards in the back. They are white in color with the you know, red uh, name of the company. I am also a real estate investor, uh, and also I'm getting into small time lending. So if you have a small time <laughs> requirement, uh, uh, very short requirement, please, uh, I might be able to help you. Uh, plus, I want to pitch my friend uh, Gar, who is just stepped out and he's unable to walk. Uh, he has a two five bedroom duplexes for sale in Howard Park in West Baltimore. So he, oh, there he is. He's limping. So, <laughs> <laughs> so uh, if, you, if you're looking for any deals, uh, please see. Remember your phone number? 703 405 7198. Thank you. Uh, yes, my name is Nicole Bertrand. I'm a wholesaler. And could I get a show of hands of the active rehabbers who um, have access to cash and are able to close quickly? Okay, I'd like to pass around a uh, sheet just so I can get your contact information, and I'll be in touch with you shortly. Hey everybody, I'm Steve Luray. Yes, I am a corporate sponsor of this day. Um, I have an insurance agent. I own Luray Insurance. Um, good news, my clients get paid um, when they have a claim. I paid uh, this week, unfortunately, two different claims for stolen pipes. By the way, one was on the eastern shore, so if you think it's just a Baltimore city, it's not. True story. Um, the stolen pipes in the Eastern Shore, but yeah, we're paying the claim. So, uh, Baltimore City. Um, in the back, you'll find my handy dandy yellow flyer. This is a builder's risk flyer. We throw in some theft in here. So, if your pipes get stolen, you'll call me crying and we'll pay for them. Okay? Or your air conditioner, etc. So, uh, please. Uh, I did have several houses burned down in the riots. My clients all got paid. I promise you, uh, like one client, if you do not endorse your $93,000 check, it will bounce. Uh, <laughs> they went and they deposited through the money machine. They were so excited about getting it. 
didn't endorse it, their own bank returned it. He's calling and yelling at me. The insurance check was good, I promise you. Um, wow. We do everything. Um, again, all of them, commercial insurance, anything property casualty related. Uh, if you have apartments, uh, if you have a vacant property you're rehabbing, please call us. We just signed up some new carriers. We are crushing it. You think you're paying too much? You are. Call me. <laughs> phone number is 410-602-2636 and you'll find the largest business card in the world. <laughs> Hello, I'm Nick Carey and I have a bunch, I've got about 15 or 20 tax foreclosure properties for sale. We have properties starting as low as $9,000 and we have some tenant occupied properties and some virtually ready to rent properties in the $20,000 range. So if you're interested in rental properties in Baltimore City, then uh, just come see the guy with the crab on the hat or the crab on the back. And my number is 301-332-5496. Thank you, bye. Hi everybody, my name is Bill Rogopoulos. I am a uh, realtor, investor-friendly investor realtor from Rebate Realty USA. I'm here specifically because I have a 10-unit apartment building. Um, I have a buyer. Some of the funding kind of fell through. I'm looking for a junior partner or a 50-50 partner. Can be negotiated. Um, if, if that's something that may interest you, please contact me or just come walk up right up to me. Thank you. Phone number. Phone 9529035. give you my business card as well. Yeah, hi, good evening, everybody. Uh, the name is Anthony on Wannabe. I'm also one of the uh, sponsors here uh, through my law office and my title company. Um, I am an attorney uh, with an office in Baltimore, and my area of expertise for the last 20 years has been real estate. So I do everything concerning real estate, from settlement services to foreclosure services. Um, I'm also, I also have properties. I'm an investor just like you guys. And I have properties for sales uh, that I have acquired through tax sales, and I sell cheap to investors. I have a list. I'll put the list out back, and I'll put a flyer as well out back. Another area that I work on, and work, which is in my flyer, is collections. I collect for landlords. Landlords, have your tenants run away with any money? Well, I collect and I do it on a contingency basis. That's the only reason you can, uh, you will pay any money is if we collect any money. So that's a good idea. Uh, my phone number is 410-779-7040. I'll have my cards and flyers at the back. And it's kind of hard to get me on the phone, so, but email, I'm an email junkie, so I always look at my email, day in, day out. So, I'll have my cards. So, say your email. Uh, the email is, oh, it's a long, you have to look at the card. It's a long email. It's a long email. Look at my name, you know it's Hello everyone. Hello. Good. First and foremost, thank you all for having this um, event and giving us this opportunity to do so. My name is Ayanna Kamara. Well, I'm up here wearing a lot of hats, honestly. Um, first and foremost, definitely want to be an investor, a um, real estate investor, as well as the young lady who first came up here. I'm also a legal um, shield associate. With that, I also manage my own financial management company called Kingdom Principles Financial. And I am also an author. The, the title of the book is A Recipe to Extraordinary Success, as we are here wanting to obtain extraordinary success, a guide for achievers. The book is available on Amazon.com, as well as Barnes & Noble, so purchase it, support it, please. And also, an aspiring motivational speaker. So if you are looking for a motivational speaker or you're having an event and you're looking for someone to inspire your audience, give me a call. My number is 240-498-2790. Again, the number is 240-498-2790. Thank you. Hello, everybody. 
everybody. Uh, Jason Cohen. Uh, can I get a quick show of hands of anybody investing in DC? Okay. So that's why I came up, because I it was going to be hard to find you guys. Um, I'm looking for any deals in Washington, DC. Um, so if you have anything, please let me know. And anybody interested in getting to know DC better, we have a meetup group that meets every month. We have about 500 people, nowhere near as many as you guys, but we're trying. Um, so let me know if you guys want to come to DC and learn about DC. Thanks a lot. Phone number 202 957 Jason Cohen. Thank you. Hello, everyone. Uh, this is my first meetup. Uh, my name is James Bowerman. I started getting into the idea of investing back in May. Since then, I've been kind of educating myself and kind of building a team. Uh, I'm kind of focused in the Dundalk market area, 21222. I'm looking to do flips to start off with. So uh, I'm kind of finding, uh, looking for lenders right now for financing options. Uh, any wholesalers out there, feel free to connect with me. I'll leave some cards in the back. They'll be the purple ones. Um, and I also have a background. I'm the creative director for a digital marketing company. So. Anyone interested in website design, branding, things like that, I can also help you out there. Yeah. Great, phone number. Sorry, phone number 410 971 8004. How's everybody doing tonight? Right. Right. This is why you get last. <laughs> Grab the bell so you can't ring it. My name's Steve with Baltimore Discount Houses. You can find us at www.baltimorediscounthouses.com or you can call me directly at 443-622-5498. Um, anybody here with deep pockets? <laughs> We have 161 assisted living beds for sale. 10 different properties. We're asking 27 million for the whole batch. So if anybody's interested or has connections in the assisted living facility, please give me a call. 443-622-5490. Thanks. because it took under three minutes. Good job. <laughs> phone number first. We're going to get that, right? I still got the bell. You're ready for the phone number? 704-802-WAVE. That's 9283. Why do you want the phone number? Because I have deals, deals, deals. Where is Curtis Collins? Raise your hand, stand up for me. Those of you who can't find me, you want to find that man. You want to get to know him. Money and deals. All right? I'm off of, if you can't count the waters, learn to ride the waves. And I do like to motivate. <laughs> so if you want to get some business done, rehabs, wholesaling, let me know what you got. Let me know what you want. And we'll get it done. Have some fun with midnight. 704. 802 Wave. Thank you guys for the work you're doing. You're making a difference. So good to see you again. Give me a hand. Come on, give me a hand. Good evening, everyone. My name is Christina Ramirez. I'm a real estate agent with Douglas Realty. I also invest in Baltimore City and um, I'm based out of Laurel. If you need agent services for any reason, please. Um, look me up. I'm looking to expand my retail side as well as the investor side, and you can reach me most easily at C Ramirez. That's R A M I R E Z at GoDouglasRealty.com. Thanks. I'm a, for anyone that doesn't know me, my name is Bill Ames. How did you um, go? Uh, yeah. Um, it's right here. Um, I'm an active rehabber uh, looking for deals. If you're a, a wholesaler or you're thinking about wholesaling or you're going to have a deal under contract in a couple weeks, I have these flyers on the back table that tells you exactly what I'm looking for. Um, contact numbers for myself and my partner. My cell phone is 410-207-1151.
Um, also have business cards. So we're, uh, we have a lot of cash sitting. We're looking to buy deals quick, uh, primarily Anne Arundel County, Baltimore County. But um, we're ready to buy them. Just call me, 410 Thank you. All right. All right. Thank you. Thank you. Everybody, please give Bill a big hand. Seriously. <laughs> Bill was one of the founders of this meetup. Extraordinary man. Very, very, very good guy. Very successful investor as well. If you guys have really solid wholesale deals, he'll buy them for you for me in a minute. We had a deal that we did with him last summer. We had it under contract. In 23 hours, we assigned it to him and his partner. He's serious. Okay, so tonight um, we're gonna we're gonna have a panel. Each one of these folks, we have a. I'll, I'll get into their names in all in a little while, but with formal introductions, and we're gonna go through through a deal from the mailing list to the mailbox to the check. So you guys will get to see, and it's, it's really good. There's a bunch of new people here, too, because this is going to be really good for you. Um, so next, we're going to have a um, sponsored presentation. Judy, the floor oh. is yours. Yeah, James. Yeah. James is going to lead off. Okay. Do you want to get mic'd up? Uh, good evening, everybody. We're a sponsor with the organization. We are the power end, and I'm here representing our team. I'm James Cooper, Judy Shandua, Regina and Kwaisi, and we're going to talk to you tonight about another opportunity to utilize your money to invest or to work in the real estate market. So we work for an organization called First Financial Security, and our, our mission is to inform, educate, and empower individuals, families, and entrepreneurs and business owners about this next generation of product that I'm, we're going to talk about this evening. And what it does, it helps you protect your savings, put your compound interest to work for you, minimize and use tax advantage, tax advantage savings and lifetime income, and you can redirect the funds that you're already using to gain a better value for your money. So let's look at a chart. This is a pretty normal chart. This red line indicates the market from 1997 until very recently. If you notice the ups and downs, this is a normal, court, a normal occurrence in the market. You make money, you lose money. Now if you look at the next line, the blue line, this is where our, the people that we work with stay. What I want to point out is that as the market goes up, so does the money that you're making. But then as the market goes down, and I want to point out in 2000, we had a little thing called the dot bomb. Then we had 9-11 come up the market crashed. Then the market climbed for a long time, and then everyone in this real room remembers 2007, 2008, and 2009. Where everyone was losing money during that time that was invested in the market, our clients stayed still. Next slide, please. So, there's two types of, you know, two types of ways to go. There's fixed products which have a low rate of return and a safety of your principal. Next, you have what everyone uses in the market, variable products, interest products, great upside potential, but you risk your principal. What we do is we have a product that fits in the middle, Goldilocks product, if you will, and that product has a safety of principal along with the upside potential. And so what it, it's impossible to share with you all the details associated with this product in 10 minutes. It's just flat out not going to happen. But what we can share with you is some of the outcomes you can achieve by utilizing this project as, a, as an alternative vault for your resources um, for funding your deals. So how can you make money on your money while still using your money to invest in real estate? And that's uh, essentially by talking with us. Uh, we're licensed insurance agents, and we'll share a little bit more about why you probably haven't heard about these products, particularly here on the East Coast. But, and James already referenced, uh, basically these products offer guarantees and losses. You become your own bank, and uh, you can use your funds for whatever you want. There are no restrictions. Next slide. For example, here's a rehab example. Let's say you have $100,000 in your account value. 
you have available to you to borrow up to $90,000 of your account value, 90%. So one of the things I really want to point out here is there's no risk of blowing up your account. You can do a deal with your daughter, your sister, you can buy that vacation home. Uh, we're all familiar with self-directed IRAs. We use them for investing, they're not going anywhere. This is just an addition, a possible alternative in addition to your investing strategy. Next slide, please. Here's a private lending example. I know we have a fair number of private lenders. Quasi uh, and myself are, are also private lenders utilizing this strategy. Uh, another example, if you're borrowing from yourself at bank-like rates, say around 5%, and you're lending at 12%, you're essentially creating arbitrage of about 7% cash flow uh, on your lending practices. And again, the way that we do this, when you borrow the $90,000 from your account, that $90,000 is not actually coming out of your account. It's continuing to grow. That full $100,000 is still gaining interest at one, even though you've borrowed money from yourself. That's the magic of the arbitrage. Now, there's several ways you can fund your account, cash. We also work with people who have maybe Roth self-directed IRAs. Um, you do have to fund it over time. It is a product which you can't use. There's a limited amount of money you can dump into it all at once. We'll let you keep going that as we move forward. Next slide. And how did, why haven't you heard of this? If any of you, I've been raising, <laughs> actually several people in the room have, I, we've had. But if you're familiar with Baker's Code, um, and this is the book, on pages 118 and 119, it takes a licensed insurance agent to speak to these products, uh, or someone who owns the products can speak with these products. It's just a regulation. So if you haven't been talking with, with uh, people who represent these types of products and are licensed to represent them, then you probably haven't heard of them. They're much more common on the West Coast, and we're trying to bring that education and that knowledge through BWI Meetup to the East Coast. The, only, the other thing that we can help you do is if you're a very, if you're successful a business owner, we just want to let you know that we can also work with you on your corporate plans. So if we're on case, the whole nine yards. Next slide. On the five benefits side, historically speaking, uh, they have not been very advantageous for business owners, but there are recent changes in regulations which provide you some flexibility that didn't exist previously. Again, not something we can tremendously educate on in detail here, but hopefully we can pique your interest and have a conversation in the future. Seven simple. Go ahead. Oops, wrong way. Um, I know a lot of people are educated on seven simple. You can go through the whole slide. Uh, and we just want to share with you that, as you can see by this example, there are potentially better alternatives to set and simple than 401ks. And so um, you, can, you can dump 12.5 into a set, but in a 401k, uh, we can get you with a catch up match to about 36,000 uh, on average. So, next slide. The only last thing I'm going to show the business owners in the room, and you have uh, flyers on your on your chair. Um, the first is an example of the type of product we talk about for the lending. Uh, that's the Brother A, Brother B, and the other benefits it offers you. On the other side is something that is about our um, business program. And so, if you didn't get one, uh, I see and Regina will hand them out. We also have a data form on your chair. If you're interested in learning more, fill it out. Bring it to us. We're going to have a raffle at the end for a copy of the Bankers Code. The last thing I want to share with the business owners, next slide, please, is this new flexibility in the, in the profit sharing plans actually um, allows us to work with you for safe harbor plans, uh, where for uh, where this particular owner we were able to get them 91 percent of their contribution to their retirement plans went into their pocket versus their employees' pockets. So if you're a business owner, uh, it's, it's just worth filling out the information and taking a look. Next slide. Beyond that, um, everything you do with us is complimentary, confidential. We're happy to run your numbers, uh, be it personally or as a business. Uh, I would also encourage you on your chair uh, is, should be information uh, about, oh sorry, the flyers for our webinar. <laughs> are out on our table, we're having a table today. And if you go to the Sponsors tab on the web page, the Meetup group, you can click on our first financial link, and uh, basically it'll, it'll allow you to register for our 
uh, our webinars on the this coming Saturday and the last Monday of every month. Right. Anything else? Did so, we make it? Yes. Yes. I have to let you know. We were working on this slide deck last night, and I told Judy that it is impossible to go through 16 slides in 10 minutes, and only Judy could get through 16 slides in 10 minutes with me taking up extra time on slide three. So, congratulations. Yeah. Um, if you have questions, uh, there's a team of four of us here tonight. We'd be happy to entertain them again. Please give us your information, and we'd be happy to work with you. Thank you very much. Okay, so now we're going to get to the meat of the meeting. Um, I'd like to introduce a wholesaler that a lot of you probably know. If not, you're about to meet a really successful lady who's done amazing things. Um, she's known as the Philly Wholesaler. Well, close enough. But that's okay. <laughs> chick? That Philly Wholesaler chick is actually the handle, but... <laughs> yeah, I left the chick off because... I left the tick off. Anyway, um, Amon has done over 140 wholesale deals. She has a Facebook page, Free Real Estate Wholesaling, wholesaling Training for Newbies. She's got almost 5,000 members on that. Pretty amazing. And um, she's spoken from Richmond to New York, and we're really, really proud and happy to have her here. The stage is yours. Right? 
there's new construction. This is the same block that that, that property is on, 1532 Dorn Street. There was, new, there was new construction on the block, so I got really excited. Well, number one, I got excited because of where it was located. That's number one. These people purchased the property, this is 2015, they purchased it in 2011, I think, for like $1,800. 1800 bucks, right? So of course, ideally, right, I wanted to get the property for like 15. So I'm like, yo, you got it for 1800. Like, you know, they initially were, you know, they threw the number out of 45,000. Like, how do you justify someone paying 45,000 on a property that you purchased like not even four years ago for 1800 bucks? They knew what they had. They're investors too. That was the other thing. So um, ideally, I would like to have gotten this property under contract for like fifteen, twenty thousand dollars tops. Um, however, that wasn't the case. And I typically will walk away from it. You know, I mean, the number has to be right for me because I know, you know, getting a property under contract at a specific price point to be able to then turn. You can sell any property. This is what I always say: you can sell any property. Any property is going to sell. The question that you need to ask yourselves is how quickly is it going to, can you turn around and sell the property, right? So um, they, you know, wanted 45. I checked the cash sales um, around the area because I have MLS access. And so I knew that even at $45,000 that we could, you know, it, it still is like a home run type of deal. So, you know, you know, knowing that, you know, um, I took in, you have to take into account the block that it's on, the area it's in, you know, what, you know, what the sales have been. Um, and that's a really quick way. I mean, a lot of, you got Gordon here who's a rehabber. You know, a lot of people talk about, you know, Gordon, Amy, Andy, and Bill, and the other people here. You know, after repair value, people get freaked out about how do I, you know, accurately calculate that number. A quick and easy way to determine, like if you really don't are comfortable with those numbers, is to really look and see what other investors have paid cash for properties in an area. So I, I took all that into account. The, low, the, the section of town, um, the block that it was on, um, what was happening in the area, right, and then the price. And I knew that, you know, it was still, you know, and this is the other thing too, that, you know, I'm a type of wholesaler um, that, you know, I want my buyers to be able to, when I say I have a deal, that they jump about out of their seat, which is what happened with this deal, right? I get it for a discount and they get it for a discount and they make a lot of money. So, I can go to the next slide, Amy. And this was on, this is the same block, so it was new construction on this block, and there were multiple rehabs on this block. That in itself, if you know nothing, <laughs> that should tell you a lot, that this is something that um, provided you get the property at, at a great price, of course. Um, that this is something that you really want to consider um, pursuing. So we agreed upon, you know, agreed upon 45000 Purchase price of forty-five thousand, right? Um, I must say that uh, you know you will encounter some sellers who are you know a little rather difficult, and so it took us three attempts to get this property under contract. I don't. Even, I will spare you the story, <laughs> okay? Um, and uh, so I got the property under contract. So I need to say, I have buyers that are looking to buy property in this area. A lot of people, a lot of investors looking to buy property in this area. Now, before I even had it under contract, I had buyers for the deal, right? I, we put this property under contract on a Saturday. Monday, now, you know, Sunday I wasn't doing anything, right? Saturday I wasn't doing anything either. So I have people literally, you know, literally, well not literally, but banging on my virtual door for this property. And, um, you know, you know, the, the thing was, you know, hey, can you, you know, can you do 50? No, we can't do 50. It's 
we're asking for price for it. Either you want it or you don't want it. So I knew what I had, and um, my buyer, you know, bought it, you know, um, signed me, uh, what gave me the two, well, not gave me, gave the, uh, had him take the $2,000 nine, non, <laughs> my tongue is tied tonight, non refundable um, deposit to the title company, right? And, uh, you know, took title to come back in like one week. And then um, it was just a matter of setting a closing date and, uh, and, and sold the property for $55,000. So um, I don't know how much time I have left. Four minutes. So I'm going to take this four minutes. So are there any people who are new wholesaling in here? Right? So, you know, Amy, bye. So Amy, you know, Andy said that, you know, this tonight's presentation, you know, between myself, Gordon, and, and uh, Joe, you know, from the, what was it, the <laughs> mailing list? From the mailing list to, to the, the mailbox. To the mailbox, to the check. To the yeah. check. So, you know, you need to, I don't, I'm not from Baltimore, but I'm, I know a lot of people, I, you know, in Baltimore, and I'm familiar with some of the areas that appear to be, you know, pretty sizzling hot areas, like at Canton. Right Bells on. Point, uh, said other town, Kingstown, whatever it is. But anyway, so these are Hampton, Hampton, right? Hampton, right? These are areas that you want to, you know, you want to target. People always say, "Well, where do I need to target?" Well, find out where people are heavily investing, invest the areas that people are heavily investing in, and then that that right there is going to tell you why got people are willing to buy. And you need to target sellers or potential sellers in those areas. So how do you do that? Probing, inherit lists. I always say that um, the easiest, quickest, fastest way to a deal, in my opinion and in my experience, are free and clear, right? Um, not just absentee owners, but absentee owners who own their property free and clear. So, and then vacants and things like that. So you want to target um, property owners in those areas. Send out your yellow letter, send out a postcard, pick up the phone, right? You can pick up the phone, right? Um, there's a lot of uh, tried and true, tried and true, tested um, ways of, um, you know, picking up deals that still work today, um, for sale by owner. You know, calling for sale by owner um, signs and things like that. But you got to take massive. People always think about talk about taking massive action or taking action. No, you need to take consistent massive action. And whatever you're going to do, if it's banded signs, if it's yellow letters, if it's postcards, be sure to be consistent at doing it. I have a student. I'm going to share this and I'm going to shut it down. I have a student of mine who, you know, he saw that a new student, a newer student, who has been working with me for two months, you know, was like getting deals on the counter. He took action, right? He didn't just mail one time, right? This other student, um, I guess, thought that it was my responsibility <coughs> that he should be getting deals on the counter. You have to do the work, essentially. I'm just there to guide and direct you. But you have to be consistent. You can't send out a thousand letters, get some phone calls, and no one raises their hand and say, oh, well, it doesn't work. You got to, you know, if you know anything about statistic, you know, statistically, you know, how you, you know, how deals come apart, I mean, come, come about, is that you got to be consistent. People, how many times do you have to see an advertisement before you raise your hand and say, hey, I think I'm going to be interested, right? And, and, and uh, working with Steve LeRae for, for insurance. Right? So it's no different for the people that you're marketing to as well. So if you don't if you don't leave with anything other than take consistent massive action. And that's all I got. Okay, next up is Gordon Stebbings. Um, Gordon is a very, very talented person in this in this industry. He's um, he's got a very successful rehab 
wholesaler. Can you do some buy and hold as well? No, no, I don't do that. I don't do that. Okay. No, I don't okay. Do that. Uh, okay. I'm not as successful at putting microphones. <laughs> Can you help me with that? Maybe I don't even know where it really works. I don't know if the battery's good. Yeah. I feel like I'm going to miss out on that. Do you want to use this or not? I don't know. I really sound like standing in one place. So <laughs> I should definitely. We're going to do a question and answer session after this. So you'll get to ask as many questions as goes as deep down as you can. We can just do the question and answer if you want. No, we want to know about you. <laughs> How is everybody? Great. Great. Yeah. yeah. My name is Gordon. Um, I'm 33 years old. I live in Lutherville, Maryland. Um, I have one wife and one daughter.